Hi folks, we've had a lot of questions about the Trico versus the Fog Buster. Here's what we think. Fog Buster, this guy right here, it's the way to go over the Trico. Here's why. The most important thing for us is clearing chips. This does a great job with the air pressure. I can't speak to whether it uses less air than the Trico, but I don't think it uses more. You do need a decent sized compressor to run these. We have a five horsepower, 80 gallon. You don't need one that big, but you need a decent compressor. Uh, what we like about this, we like this brass tube. I find it easier to point accurately where I want it to clear chips. It is a pretty sensitive range. If you have it just an inch or two to the left or right, it's not necessarily going to get on the cutter. May still clear chips depending on your part. I do not like this magnetic thing. I find that it um, moves around, especially if you're doing a more aggressive cut. I find this rod sometimes hits the top of at least of our 440. Easy fix, I'll come back to that in a second. We have this one mounted inside our brand new other 440. We just hooked up this morning and we've got it on the backside, much smarter place to put it. We've also got our line for our air hose to come out over here. The Trico, nothing wrong with it, but it's significantly more expensive. Ours has actually really deteriorated lately, may partly due, due to its age or use, but these nozzles I find tend to get brittle and crack. And unlike the Fog Buster, where it's just a generic brass tube, this tip here is proprietary and actually part of the mixing in the system. So you've got to buy these, and I didn't find that to just be the best experience. It's, again, significantly more expensive. We have two lines. Our Fog Busters only have one. You can purchase a second line for the Fog Buster. I haven't found it necessary yet, but even two lines on the Fog Buster is cheaper than the two-line Trico. We also had to add in our solenoid. Um, ourselves, not a big deal, but the Tormach purchase of the Fog Buster comes with one. Here you're limited to using one or two of their types of coolant. They're very expensive, but they last forever. So th the reality is they're not expensive. $100 lasts us well over a year or two, depending on use. Um, we right now are using some QualiChem, I believe. I need to check that um, in our fog buster and we've only had it for a few months it works great it cuts great um, no complaints at all so my recommendation if you don't know what to do is buy this buy it with one line i believe you can add a second one later but don't quote me on that um, and uh, rock and roll folks take care